So can we learn Python in 30 days? What is the process that we need to follow, right? I know Python is one of the easiest language that you know, right? Generally people who are stuck, right? Especially I think for freshers, for known IT or manual testers, if you want to jump into the automation, right? I think Python is one of the easiest language that I have tried. So what if I tell you that, yes, you can learn in 30 days, Python, you can start your journey towards coding also, right? I know many of you will have this question, okay, promoter, but I have a coding fear. Is it really possible to do that, right? Yes, it is absolutely possible, right? If you do, if you don't know, last year we started with Python automation batch, right? For Python 0x and Python 1x batch, we have already done it, right? So exactly that the roadmap that I'm going to show you with 30 day plan, right? It is basically validated by the thousand plus students. So let me jump into the 30 days plan. If, if you see this, right? So we have divided the 30 days in a very structured manner. But before you jump into the 30 day plan, right? Because we have very, very important things I want to tell you, right? First of all, why Python, right? So there are five reasons. Basically, it is good for beginners. If you have a coding fear like me, for example, when I have started right? I had a coding fear right before jumping to Java right I was basically learning Python first Python basically actually helped me to jump from my next company right which where I have basically doubled my package I was doing IPM with Python at the time in Creo sense okay so this is where, where I have done it so all the people who are saying that promoter I have a coding fear and everything Python is one of the easiest language very popular language right now in the market right but I know only positive side if I say right you will say that okay promote there are negative side also which is yes out of 10 jobs if you find over the internet for automation right seven jobs are related to Java, but there are three jobs also there, right? Which are related to Python or any other language, right? So go for it also, right? I have seen may, many of my students who are able to crack their interview question because of the Python, they have a knowledge of Python and they are able to basically whatever the question it was asked, they were able to do it, right? So overall, in a nutshell, what I'm trying to say is yes, in 30 days, it is possible to learn Python and the process is very simple. Let me show you what. What you need to do is make sure you give one hour per day. So let me zoom out a little bit, which is very, very important. The most important thing is one hour per day. If you are committed that much easily you can do it all the students 0x batch 1x batch they have done it and I'm, this is a very proven method that i'm showing you right now okay or if you are a working uh, woman or for example if you are already have some children so everything right these things happens also so i think if you try to give at least four to five hours per week that also works but you have to give some extra hours in the end that is what i want but little bit disclaimer okay we are going to cover syntax mostly for the python in 30 days right 30 hours basically right but coding practice is ongoing that is the most important thing that you need to remember right so we have divided into three parts i have divided into four parts basically first of all your target will be learning the basics of python which is initially for your target your why python learning installation keywords operator for loop loops and conditions and functions and strength followed by the medium medium concepts which are basically lambda expression map filter which are extra which will help you in automation point of view as well as development point of view in future also right then you then it comes to oops oops is super important guys please pay attention it is super important to learn for an automation perspective because oops is something that we are going to use in any kind of automation even it is an api automation web automation even if you are if you're developing your python application oops is important and the advanced concept like design patterns asynchronous programming and multi-threading which are very small small topics that you can basically cover side by side with practice and all but that is not enough because after covering the python right it is important that you practice a lot that's where the things are important because see we have basically created a 150 question inter uh, interview questions which are mostly asked for the automation interview as well as development right i have seen it uh, these guys i have taken more than 400 plus interviews the, the sheet that we have created it is basically a curated list and validated list from the students so you see all the interview questions like light right hand triangle left hand triangle string reverse duplicate hash map uh, to some problem of lead code and everything right design patterns and everything which are important in this case okay now pay attention where what i am trying to say not only the interview questions you have to do the top interview questions of lead code also which i generally recommend for easy challenges, you can do 15 challenges and you will feel more and more confident in this case, right? So question is syntax learning is 30 days plus side by side daily. You need to do coding practice also side by side, right? You have to do it one time, two times, try to understand and that is where it is important, right? So if you need the coding interview question, just give me yes in the chat and give me 100 likes so that I will just pin this all the documents that you need into the chat. And also one more thing that we have created a Python notes for you, especially which will be help you to learn all the topic that we are discussing. So if you need the Python sheet where we have noted down all the Python concepts, API concepts, as well as Selenium concept and the playwright important concepts which are required to become an automation tester. If you need that, those also I have added. Make sure you comment yes in the chat and give me a thumbs up so that you can, it will be important for you, right? The same concept that I'm going to show you, do batch ID, which is Python automation tester, 2x batch is getting launches or live classes for three months we are covering where we will cover Python, API automation, Selenium in three months thoroughly with the resume building and LinkedIn hacks. 
batch that we are basically covering side by side the batch is getting launched january and we are basically starting make sure you join it in early bird because as a early bird basically we are giving you seven plus extra bonuses especially for non it and fresher people it is important that you should learn about the manual testing stuff plus a postman and sd.club lifetime access where you can get job referrals as well as 24 7 doubt sessions all are basically launched and you can try out link in the description you can check it out batch is getting started and we are closing the enrollment also so make sure if you are if you want to be a part of it you want to learn from me in the span of three months our target is to become an automation tester especially with python and we will start applying also side by side right so that is our target a early bird discount is getting added link in the description do check it out okay and if you need all the documents related to coding interview 30 day plan all the screenshots i will put into a folder make sure you give it a like and give me yes in the chat i will add into pinned pinned comment also right i hope this helps thanks a lot for loving these kind of videos let me know if you need any help related to any other topic which roadmap you need right do comment down which roadmap you need next i'll create it and thanks for watching bye bye this is rose promote signing off